doing great. I'm doing great. I called it. I said it's gonna be early. Don't blink. The punches he was hitting me with, I was catching all of them. He couldn't hurt me. I told y'all at the media workout and everything. He talked so much, I'm gonna put him in. He talked. He buried a hole. I'm gonna put him in. I told you. It looked like earlier in the second round you got knocked back to the ropes. That didn't hurt you. Did I? Did I back up? I kept coming. That's what fighters do. He caught me with some shots, but that's part of boxing. I kept moving. All counters, all counters. He opened, he throw wide shots. I told you a straight straight shot puncher was gonna get him. I told you guys this. All straight punches was gonna get him. People was throwing stuff in the ring. You know, there was a lot of uh, people in here with Evan Rodriguez. My people on the other side, they was throwing stuff in the ring, disrespecting me. You know what I mean? I'm like, man, this is, this is athletes. They can't be allowed to be, they gotta get put out. They can't be allowed to do that. They paid their money, but I'm trying to put on a show for the people that want to see the show. You know, good or bad, I'm a sportsman. They would've been disrespectful, throwing stuff and everything. But it's cool, it, it comes with it. Adonis Stevenson, you know what it is. At what point did you feel like you had the fight in hand? The first round when I touched him. You know, they kept telling me to walk to him. Second round, he threw a lot of punches. He threw a lot of punches. And I said, you know what, I can step to him now. He was open for everything all the counters and everything, because he was throwing wide. You know, a couple times he got me to throw wide. I said, you know what, get back to your game plan, throwing sharp punches. Were you looking for a big win in order to press yourself right into title contention? We got a big fight. We got a, we got a big fight in front of us. It'll be announced in the next couple weeks. We got a big fight in front of us. If you've been paying attention to the media, you know what it is. Of course, we win 10 ounce gloves. Of course I felt it. So now they can say, oh, he can't take a punch. Because he hit me with a nice, what was it, right hand? Nice yeah. right hand, and I took it like a champ. They keep saying, they keep saying, oh, he can't take a punch, he can't take a punch. Only been down twice in 20 fights. You know, I've been hit with a couple shots, and I went through it. That, that kid hit me with a nice shot tonight. Nice, but I kept my composure and, and kept on. I called it. I said it'd be early. Don't blink. I said it about three or four times. Don't blink. Before you It was a blessing. It made me bust my butt. It made me, it made me bust my butt. I, I can't really say I'm glad I lost, but it kind of helped me more than anything. And that's just being truthful. It helped me. You know, uh, I was getting into like a kind of mode. I had some things going on, you know, but that's part of life. Before you run out, what's uh, anything you want to say to your fans watching back home? Keep supporting me. I'm going to keep giving you good knockouts and good shows. Thanks, Thomas. Congratulations.